January, what have you been like to me? 2019's been amazing for me already, like, honest to God. Like, the first thing that's happened to me was Mini Lad, who's one of my favourite YouTubers, replied to my tweet. <laughs> also, I also got my food safety certificate because I am doing catering in college in September of 2019. And also, Ariana released seven rings. And the last one being Sunny Day, Mini Lad's girlfriend, liking my tweet. So I am very happy with that. Like, I am so happy how the first month of this year has been. Like, it's just been amazing. Like, I'm happier as I am before, you know, after what happened back in December of 2018. If you haven't watched my previous video, you should. The link is in the description. And yeah, I have been the happiest person on earth. Like, yeah, I had a cold and whatnot, but oh my God, like literally, I still think this year has been amazing so far. Like, and also thank you next is gonna be released in February. I cannot wait any longer for that. Honestly, like I cannot wait to see what February will bring in store for me because I swear 2019 is going awesome already. I feel like, I don't know, I should speak too soon, but I feel like the rest of the year is going to be quite rubbish. I'm just saying, because when it gets to March, like it gets so bad. Don't even ask me why, but January of 2019 has snapped really hard on me. Like I have received so many happy things in life you know, my favourite YouTuber finally knowing who I am. Same with his girlfriend, Sunny Day. And also knowing that Ariana released Seven Rings, which is number one in my country, by the way. And also releasing Thank You Next on February 8th. Honest to God, like, February is going to be a good one. Like, as good, probably as good as January, of course. Like, I'm sorry for the background noises, but today is really windy. It's like 55 miles per hour winds, and yeah, you're probably going to hear some effects, you know, background noises that you don't normally hear, but don't worry, this is probably just one video where you're going to hear all that. So, yeah, the first one being Mini Lad replying to my tweet, and yeah, I can tell the story for you to that right now. Um, so, basically... Um, the Mini Lad Disciple merch came on, I think, the 10th of January. No, or the 11th. I think it was the 11th of January or the 10th. One of those dates anyway. And I wanted to post it to my favourite YouTuber, Mini Lad, about it. And <laughs> I was so wrong with everything. Like, like, I'm sorry for the sniffles. I'm still recovering from a cold as well. So, yeah. Um, so, yeah, as I said, I got my Mini Lad and Disciple merch probably on the 11th of January. And just one day on a weekend, January 13th, I decided to um, take photos of myself with the merch. And I posted the, posted the tweet when I got to bed. And... Um, Oh my god, I, I actually said to myself, I know for the fact I'm not even gonna get nothing, like, you know, I'm not even gonna get any notifications in the morning. The next morning came around quite quickly, and, oh my god, I was eating my skinny crumpets, and I just turned on my iPad Air, which I normally use in the morning anyway, and holy shit, I'm sorry for the language, but... Oh my god, I was so speechless. I have not been speechless in the last couple of years. Well, two years, I should say, or a year. But, <laughs> yeah, like, oh my lord. Like, I looked through my notifications, and um, I saw a notification saying um, Craig Thompson replied. I actually thought it was just a normal, regular Twitter notification. Um, you know, when you get tweets from a celebrity and like that. That's what I thought. And then I realized he replied. I was like, what? 
like i didn't even know what was going through my mind right now like oh my god oh i cried for like five to ten minutes and my mum said what's wrong i'm like mum just give me a couple of minutes to say what happened to me because i'm just speechless <sighs> literally i finished my skinny crumpets first and then i told her my favorite youtuber mini that just noticed me he replied to my tweet and she was so happy of me like she she was just like well that's good for you and all that you know like i went upstairs with happiness and i wanted to find out if um mini lad also liked it and maybe retweeted it as well but no <laughs> he did not but hey look it's better than nothing it's not rude you know i said the night before well the day before i found out you know after minutes after i sent out that tweet i said to myself i know i'm not even gonna get anything in the morning like yeah and also another note disciples the one who made the merch um with mini lad liked my tweet which was nice okay so the next thing was ariana releasing seven rings and i was so excited and then like the day when it released i was so sick like i i didn't even get asleep like i didn't even get to sleep on that night poor me um and like I couldn't stop sneezing, blowing my nose, coughing, oh my god, it was like the worst, like, you know, and it didn't help that as well, Mini Lad just moved to Portland in Oregon, and like, I was like, you know what, I can't even go back to sleep, so my Nintendo Switch was left upstairs, so I was like, you know what, just watch Seven Rings, the music video, and to be honest, from first expectations when I heard the snippet, I was not too excited and then when I heard the full song that came out at 5am I I don't know I was still not even into it at the time like I gave it a 6 out of 10 and then unfortunately I was that bad with a cold I had to be sent home from school and you know what I'm like with school I absolutely love school and like I was so upset because I I went home for the first time in many years because I don't normally get sent home or stay at home when it comes to me being sick because my staff members call me a trooper and like that but I was just really bad on that day but then um and then came in the next week on Monday um my teacher told me that I was going to do this food hygiene test because I already brought in my college application in like like after mini lad's birthday it was like on the day when the mini lad merch arrived so yeah i was doing the food hygiene test and it was in a different class like i was the only one in the class who was not in the other class and it was just interesting like just to learn how food hygiene works there's cross contamination and all that you know you can find out like loads of things about food and i think food differently now compared to what i used to think about it and then yeah because um my teacher said that i would be doing it on a wednesday and a thursday only for one week though and i could not go to the gym because of the food hygiene thing and i was like okay maybe one week will do because i guess it's um <laughs> Well, it isn't the first week back but um yes i did the food hygiene test i revised myself before doing the lesson and i was quite confident on doing the exam i did pass and i got a certificate as well i was very happy of myself um and now the last thing is that this happened only two days ago because i seen on um sunny day's instagram story by the way follow her on instagram and so many lads as well you know follow mini lad and sunny day onto instagram links will be in the description and she reached a thousand posts so i was like you know what i'll congratulate her on twitter of course and then um i it took it took like about 40 minutes to know what would happen because i knew we'd get naffle and then i looked through my notifications and then it said sunny day liked your tweet i was like oh okay i was quite surprised because i have mentioned it on tweets in the past and she hasn't noticed me now not gonna lie before mini lads was going to reply onto my tweet i actually thought 
Sunny Day, aka Sammy, was going to notice me first. So that's what I thought in the first place. And then now, uh, like, you know, January 13 came and Mini Lab replied to my tweet. Then 12 days later, his girlfriend notices me by liking my tweet that I tweeted out to her. So, yeah, I just wanted to say that. So I really hope 2019 will be the best year of my life, but I don't think so. I hope it does. And um, I hope um, February will be amazing and the other months. But January's just been amazing to me so far. Let's just hope the next couple of months in 2019 will be the best ever. Okay, make sure to like this video and subscribe. Watch this video that's on the right. Basically the one that I uploaded recently and the left basically when Frankie Grande noticed my tweet for the first time in 2018 and only in 2018. Okay, I gotta go now. Bye bye.